Well, it was after nearly five hours of searching, an escaped un inmate is once again now in custody. The 17-year-old actually stabbed a security guard during a dental procedure this morning in Lakeside and then took off. Nine News reporter Courtney Yoon joined us live. She is close to the area where he was captured. Courtney, what do you know? Yeah, Kim Tom, we're right here in front of the dentist's office where that inmate escaped just before 9 a.m. this morning. Less than a block away from here on Eaton is where he was found hiding inside of a garage. Police say they had a feeling that he was still close by. And uh, he was just laying low in there until uh, either we got tired or he got tired. And uh, fortunately, it ended well and nobody was uh, further, no one else was injured. Mountain View Police Chief Steve Davis says one of his officers had a hunch that 17 year old Juan Oseguera hadn't gone far after his escape. My officer uh, earlier this morning was right on top of the call and didn't see the suspect exit the alley. So that officer, along with a couple of others, just sat on that house for the last several hours and uh, directed the canine team there, and it paid off. A neighbor next door to where he was found got this video as Osegueda was being walked out of the vacant garage he had been hiding in. Several police departments from around the area helped search for the escaped inmate. Drones, helicopters, canines, and about 100 officers assisted. If you get on top of these, these types of calls with the resources that we have, the chances of finding somebody are, are very good. It's just tedious and you just have to wait them out. And like this case, as long as you uh, have the resources and you can search yard by yard, um, it pays off and that's what happened today. The inmate had been transported from the Platte Valley Youth Facility up in Greeley for his dental procedure today in Lakeside. The security guard he stabbed right before his escape is expected to be okay. He was transported from a youth facility center out of Greeley, Colorado, all the way to Lakeside, Colorado. I don't know. How, I don't have the details or why he was transported so far, and that will all be investigated by Jefferson County Sheriff and Lakeside Police Department. Osegueda had been arrested on assault charges in Greeley back in December. The Jefferson County Sheriff's Office also says that he had a robbery charge, among other things, um, and he will also be transported to the Jefferson County Jail later on today. Tom, Kim. All right, a wild day. Thanks, Courtney. <laughs>